Hey Pokemon nerds, my name is Avin and welcome to my December update for the 20th anniversary for Pokemon. It is a little bit past December, um, and December was the last month for the 20th anniversary stuff. So December was Meloetta, and I did pick up the Clipping Carry. She has a cute little uh, clear stand, which is nice. And then I did, and she comes with the, uh, I'm really tired, the blue and white ball. And I picked up the pin box from my comic shop. I haven't opened up the Keldeo one yet. I think I'm going to do that. Um, was it Keldeo? I don't know. There's a couple I haven't opened yet. So I'm going to sit down and do that this week. And then I did get, finally, the plush. Let me tell you about getting the plush. <clears throat> and I apologize in advance. Um, one of the reasons this video is so late is my husband got terribly sick, and then I got terribly sick, and I'm still really stuffed up and congested, so <clears throat> I, I apologize now for that kind of stuff. So, huh. I checked the website the day she was supposed to come out, and she was not available for ship to home, which was a little, like, you know, eh, oh well. So I called them when they opened, and... Uh, they said they didn't get any in, and I was like, oh, okay, bummer. And then uh, there's a guy who posts, like, in a Pokemon forum who works at the Toys R Us, who posted, uh, like, a, the following week saying that um, a whole box of them had come in, and he works the nights uh, for, you know, like, stocking shelf or, like, unboxing the, unloading the truck. So he posted saying that they got a full box of them in. So I called them right when they opened the following morning, and the person I talked to asked what I was looking for, and I told her, and she came back on the phone and was like, is it the pony? And I was like, no, no, that's Keldeo, and I explained what Meloetta looks like. And she said, oh, well, I don't think those are out quite yet. We haven't finished um, unboxing everything from the shipment, so try back in a couple of days. I tried back a couple hours later. Someone else answered the phone, knew what I was talking about, and then told me that they all sold out first thing when they first opened in the morning. And I was like, oh, well, okay, I'll try again next time they get a shipment. Um, told my husband. He got on the Pokemon forum and said that that's what was going on. And then the guy I came back with, I'll check when I get to work. Not only did he check when he got back to work, he posted a photo of the display at the front of the store showing all six of them sitting there that had been sitting there all day. So I called again right when they opened and talked to somebody, and she said that they did have them, and she could hold one for me. So I was like, sweet, I have like one other errand to do and then I'll be there. I did my couple quick errands, got to Toys R Us, went to the customer service desk thing and said, you guys are holding this Pokemon for me. And she's like, oh yeah, okay. So I told her my name and she picks up a plush from behind the counter and sticks it on the counter. And she's like, there you go, sweetie. And I was like, no. And I was like, kind of done with it at that point. I was just like, Nope, that's not it. And walked away because it was the Pokey Puff Pattern Pikachu plush, not Meloetta plush. So I walked straight over to the display that you could see from the circulation uh, customer service desk, and they had three of them left. And I took it back to them, and I was like, This is what I'm looking for. This is what they were supposed to hold. And she was like, Oh, okay. Well, I'm glad we had it for you, though. So I got this, and I got the clip and carry and I paid for him and I came home and I called it a day so uh, it did make it a little worth it that I was able to use the rewards certificates that had been coming in the mail um so though it was a hassle to get her she ended up being really cheap so that was, that was kind of nice <coughs> unfortunately out of the three that they had left this is the best looking vinyl case and it's a little warped But that's okay. It is what it is. Okay, and then lastly, um, I knew these came out Black Friday, I think. And I had looked, and I didn't know exactly what it was I was seeing on GameStop.com. So I was like, huh, okay, so I passed on it. And then I think it was... My husband told me that it actually was the Mew from the 20th anniversary. It was just packaged differently with the plush Pokeball. And I was like, oh, okay. 
And then I looked a couple times. I never had it in stock. And then I think it was Pikachu. Pikachu. I think it was Pokemon Shiny Lover had um, left a comment on my video saying that GameStop still had them. So I double ch I checked again right when I saw that comment, and sure enough, it said they had them in stock. So I placed my order, and like two weeks went by without anything happening. They never charged me, and it didn't show up. And I was like, oh, okay, I'm assuming they're just out of stock, and I'll get one if it ever comes in. And then sure enough, like just a couple days after I had sort of given up hope, I got an email saying, hey, we've shipped your order, and he came. So it is the 20th anniversary of Mew with a plush Pokeball. So I'm very <coughs> excited by that. He's packaged differently. He's not in a soft vinyl thing. He's in a hard cardboard, but it still has the golden line art and all the info on the back. So I'm still, I'm still really pleased with how he looks, and I, I'm kind of glad that he's like the special edition kind of one. It just kind of makes him like even more special. So he's, I think, I kind of feel like he and Shaman are going to be the like crowning jewels of the 20th anniversary stuff. So, um, yeah. <clears throat> that concludes the 20th anniversary stuff for Pokemon for me. Uh, do keep an eye out for my next video. I'm going to try to do one um, within a week here, hopefully within just the next couple of days, summing up my, my year in Pokemon, because 2016 was the year that I sort of like really went head in, you know, head, head for whatever, what am I trying to say? I don't know. I really like, I, this is the year I really embraced uh, Pokemon. So I'm going to be gathering up all the stuff that I got, not just the stuff I've been showing for the 20th anniversary, but like the other little things I've been getting here and there. So I'm going to be doing just a big year in Pokemon video, hopefully in the next couple of days. So keep an eye out for that. And let me know if you were successful in getting everything that you guys wanted for your Pokemon collections. Train on, nerds!